Hey, it's Graham Farmer from Deck Transmission, and today we are unboxing the brand new Kanto YU4 speakers. These are brand new speakers from Kanto. Uh, we've gone for the gloss red because it matches our kitchen, and that's where we're going to use them. This actually come in a bigger outer box. We take them in the outer box out, and we fill it with food for the for the Milton Keynes homeless, and we took it to MK Food Bank this morning. Thanks, Kanto for the box. So let's jump into the inner box and we can test these out. So I have another box from here. Standard packaging, blah, let's get rid of that. And here's the speakers. So these come in a load of colours. Uh, there's a wood effect, black, teal. We've gone for the lovely red. Uh, instructions. Pretty standard remote. Oh, batteries. So these are amp speakers and these are the brand new red ones. As you can see on the back, we've got RCA inputs, we've got these big speaker cable inputs so you can join them up. There's a USB input which is for charging uh, your USB device, i.e. your phone. If it's blue, because we usually we are Bluetoothing it. We've been testing it with our phone, it's been, we've Bluetoothed it to it. Uh, power, power on. There's a great uh, subwoofer input because you can actually add a subwoofer to these. Super strong. Uh, we haven't got the sub, we've just got the standard. Uh, and optical inputs if you're going that route. The final thing that we got is uh, phone and lines. So if you wanted to just use a record player, for instance, straight into the RCA input, you could, you could have it on phono, take the record player in so you could listen to vinyl and just have these as a standalone with a record player standalone. That'd be a really nice, really nice look and it would fit nicely on the side of a, a unit for instance. Make sure you've got it online if you are using it otherwise because otherwise it's not going to sound great. The final things in the box. Brown pack, which I'm guessing is, yep, all of our wires. You've got these really nice chunky speaker cables which is not the usual, but um, you've got some feet and you've got a wire to connect. I'm guessing that's a wire, well. And you've got a wire to connect your phone or device straight to them. Like for, for me, it's gonna be an iPad straight to them. And then you've got two connectors for UK Euro plug. That's the box, cool. So let's test them out, try some music. So we tested those out on a lot of music, disco, drum and bass. Uh, we tested them on liquid, heavier drum and bass. We tested them on techno, house music, some pop music, um, and even some indie. The heavier bass sounds, they really need the subwoofer to be added for that, for that sound. Um, you, you, you can hear them, but it's not, the, the bass isn't there for the, on these model. Maybe if you stepped up to the Y6, Y6, then you'd get a better bass. But things like pop, disco, indie, house music, they all sound pretty, they sound good, uh, they sound good for house parties, and those kind of those are your markets, really. Uh, good for a house party, good for a kitchen, good for a living room if you just want to listen to music, good for listening to podcasts, if, you know, if that sort of thing you listen to. Uh, for those that do listen to podcasts, check out our podcast, Boost Podcast. I'll put them. Uh, so in summary, I like the Kanto Y4s. They're great for what we're going to use them for. They're great for a party. They're where you want people to be talking and not, you know, kitchen parties, living room parties. Great, uh, great for listening to music at home, unless you want an extra bass. And if you want an extra bass, I get the subwoofer. Thanks, Kanto, for sending them over. I hope you enjoyed this. Let us know what you got out of it, and if you've got some of these, or if you were thinking of getting some. I'll drop all the links below in the description uh, if you want to grab some. Cheers, bye.